Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I'm of the stars. This video is entitled How to Accomplish a Dimensional Shift. As you may know, there are various dimensions. We are multi-dimensional beings. And within each dimension there are various flavors that might be considered in Christian mythology the hell world, the purgatory world, and the heaven world of that dimension. If you find yourself in a very negative space, then where you are is in a negative dimension. The key, the tool, the lever to get you from a negative dimension to a positive dimension is emotion, the feeling world, your emotional body. You have to shift your emotion from negative to positive. You may notice in my work uh, quite a few blogs about hell world experiences that might have to do, for instance, with psychic powers or sorcerers or black magic, uh, things like that. Those all have to do with hell worlds and the power over, the, the desire for power over other people. Then you'll also see a category in my work called emotions, and that should give you a notion of the different kinds of emotions that you can feel. So let's say you're feeling like you really want to lord it over other people. If you can change the emotion that you feel to one of love for all beings or compassion or neutral mind, then you'll find that the world around you has changed. The dimension has shifted to a purgatory world and then, if you're highly successful, to a heaven world in the same dimension. The locus of your dimension is the chakra that your awareness is concentrating on. Now you have 12 chakras, some say 72, but at least you have 12 chakras because of the ascension process. Uh, you can place your awareness, your eternal awareness, on any chakra in your energy body and then shift your emotion to the positive to experience, say, um, the fourth chakra, your heart, um, positive. That's a really good place to start. Once more, 12 chakras, 12 dimensions, 12 gateways, right? These can be flavored negative, neutral, or positive, depending on the emotional tool you use to change the flavor of the dimension. Now, how is that handy? All right. Let's say you find yourself in a, an apocalyptic timeline, right? Uh, you've read a popular novel, and it seems to you like China and Russia are going to take over the United States and kill everyone there with a nuclear attack, okay? Well, it could be worse, right? A very bad timeline in a very bad dimension. You can optimize your timeline to make that shift. Optimize timelines and dimensions will get you there with certainty for the all through free will. Okay, so that's your affirmation. Activation of light is optimize timelines and dimensions for the all through free will. That way, if that's the very best timeline and dimension in which you can find yourself, then you'll have to stay there. But the likelihood is that you'll switch over to peace and love and light and joy and appreciation, right? Love for all beings, a place where you really love to be. So the great advantage of knowing about the dimensional shift is to have the tool, to develop the tool that allows you to shift from the ap apocalyptic scenarios in any dimension through neutral mind and on to new life in new earth as viewed through that dimension. I, I hope that's clear enough. Now, 
I have a, a category, a blog category called Transcending the Dark. And that is a, a number of tools that allow you, if you're finding yourself in a very negative space, a place where you don't want to, do, to be, surrounded by assassins, whatever it is, you know, invaded by aliens from outer space who don't like you, <laughs> wherever it is that you found yourself, it seems like the impossible thing to get away from. You can transcend that dark by using one of the tools in my blog category, Transcending the Dark. Okay, so now you know. God bless you all and keep you safe and be with you through all your days. In love, light, and joy, this is Alice B. Claggett. I am of the stars, and so are you. You're not from the apocalyptic timelines. You are of the stars. You are of love and light and joy and peace and appreciation. Okay. Oh, AwakeningWithPlanetEarth.com is a, a rare treat. Check it out. See you there then.